another one in Miami, Florida. So we drove to that location to check it out. Miami compared to Palm Beach, I feel like Miami is stampeding, grabbing everything, like blowout. It's the vibe that we are literally about to throw all this away in the dumpster. So like, it is a blowout. <laughs> this All right, guys, I do have a plan right now. Today, right now, I do have a plan. Uh, I just got out of the shower, and I was going to go outside. Can you hear that? I don't think that you can. My audio thingy is not showing anything picking up. I was going to go outside and chill in my backyard for a little bit, get some vitamin D, get some fresh air, maybe see if I could get the kids to go outside with me. Um until my hair dried and then come back in and dye it but my neighbors are out there running a chainsaw and I keep thinking they're done and then because they'll stop for like 10 15 20 minutes and then it fires right back up uh so I'm thinking I might go on a walk or something take a little uh grocery bag with me to pick up some trash because I know that probably sounds weird I know that probably sounds insanely fucking weird but every time that I go on a walk I always see trash and I think I wish I had a way to like pick that up and take it home and throw it away and I never do but today I will remember it today I will remember it but I want to go outside I'm in a very calm mood today and I don't really know why I'm in a very 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 like chill mood today I'm not very hyper and I don't feel very talkative. Cause like, like, like proof of that is that it's 4 p.m. and I've only got one minute of vlogging footage today because I just haven't been in a very talkative mood, like at all. I don't know. Can you hear that? Can you hear that? I don't know if like my mood also has to do with the fact that I'm having a lot of trouble breathing today. I'm having an insane amount of trouble breathing today. Um, I keep having these moments where my heart is racing really fast and um, I keep feeling very, very shaky. Almost like my blood sugar's low and I need to eat something. Only eating isn't fixing it. Um, cause that's just like my go-to, like my go-to is like when I get shaky, okay, well maybe I need to eat something. No, bitch, it's your lungs now. Um, maybe that's why, maybe I, I don't know. Uh, but yeah, I, I don't know what's up with me today. Also yesterday, I really wanted to go outside and play with my camera and, um, I couldn't find my damn memory card. I couldn't find my damn memory card anywhere. I always, in my head, believe myself to be an organized person. Like, my, my life is very much organized chaos. And then I need something, and I go to find it, and it's never where I fucking thought that it was. It's always in the last place that I put it before I decided to start a new organized pile. You know what I mean? Like a squirrel that buries nuts and then goes back and forgets that where they where they buried them so they start a new pile that's me well last night i found my memory card and i'm excited about it so i kind of want to go out and use my camera but then i'm like how are you gonna vlog but then i'm like you can also use that camera to vlog but then I'm also worried, oh, that, that was, that was the wrench in it. I'm worried about it because the memory card that I found is the memory card that, um, that the boys and I, and it was me, the boys, and Epps, we, uh, were in the living room ghost hunting a couple of months ago, and, uh, I had filmed a lot, a lot, and I ended up losing like half the footage because the memory card was corrupted or something. Like I lit I lost so much footage. Like it just disappeared or like the files, like the, the, the video was pixelated or the audio was awful. And um, I'm like, if I, if I take a chance, 
you know, take a risk, take a chance, make a change and break away and use that memory card, could that happen again? But also, why don't I just use my other memory card? Guys, I don't know what's wrong with me that I have it in my head that if I move my memory card around a lot, it's going to break. I don't know why I think that. I don't know why I think that. There are literally people that use the same fucking memory card for like 20 years. But in my head, I'm like, but if I, if I take it in and out a lot, it's going to break. It's built for that. Like, it's built for that. But for some fucking reason... In my brain, inanimate objects have feelings and thoughts and they have little bodies that could break if you, if you, you know, use them the way that you're supposed to use them, like taking them in and out of memory card slots. Maybe I'll just, I, I don't, I don't know why I think, I genuinely don't know why I think that. This screen, actually, I think it has, I mean, it does have a couple, it does have a couple spots in it, but I think it's held up really, really well. I really do. I think it's held up really well. And it fucking better for how expensive it is. <laughs> it fucking better for how expensive it is. Right, I'm kind of I'm 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 in a little bit of a hurry right now um, because I just exported all of the videos that I took while we were on our walk and my neighbors are not running their leaf blower anymore I thought that they were out there cutting shit down they have a very very bad tendency to just take a chainsaw to shit and just cut things down in fact I included a shot the other day of the tree in the backyard they literally cut it off cut all the branches of it off it's just sitting there like a fucking broccoli stem when you eat all of the broccoli off of it like it, i i don't know they have a very bad tendency to just chop every living thing down in their backyard so that's what i assume they were doing no they they were using a leaf blower and i think they may actually factually fucking be done so i want to put my hair dye in and go sit in the backyard for a little bit because e and i e went on the walk with me um, he, it was so gray on the way there. Like, neither of us had a jacket or any kind of, like, hoodie on or anything. And both of us were fucking freezing the whole, like, walk to the park. And then as we, like, broke down and, and came home, because we were going to stay there for, like, 45 minutes to an hour. Like, that was our goal was to stay outside and walk around for, like, 45 minutes to an hour. We, like, broke down and was like, okay, it's too fucking cold. Let's go home. And then as we're walking home, the sun comes out and it starts getting warm. It's still sunny out. I need to go be in the sunshine for a little bit. I need a little bit of vitamin D. Also, as soon as I came home, I shoveled in two cheese quesadillas and I feel a lot better. And I used my inhaler and I feel a lot better. Um, but yeah. Uh, also, fuck that memory card. Fuck that memory card. I used my Canon M200, which is the camera that Pat bought me. And I'm going to include the footage that I took on our walk because I took it, I filmed it, and I want to. Um, it's very, like, the coloring is very off, and I feel like the footage is choppy. And I'm very upset about it. Some of the best shots that I have ever gotten have been with that camera. So it confused me. It greatly confused me. But the thing is, 
that memory card, when, when I had discovered that it, there's something wrong with it, I had put it in my Sony camera. When it had, like, deleted, shredded, like, corrupted files on it, um, when we had used it during our ghost hunting video, I had put it in my Sony camera. Uh, that was the camera that I had been using whenever I had discovered that it is shitty. Um, and I remember watching it back and being like, Oh, this camera sucks. That's the camera that I use when I film my makeup videos. That camera does not suck, nor does that Canon camera suck. I think it's just time to say goodbye to that, to that, uh, to that memory card forever. I think it's just time to try to dig around and find one of my other ones. I have other ones. They're just, they don't have as much memory on them, and I don't really know why that matters. Considering that I delete everything as soon as I export it, so I don't really know why that matters, but for some reason in my head it does. It, re it really doesn't. I don't know why my brain is telling me if I go outside with this dye on my head, the sun and the wind are going to dry it out and it's not going to work. That doesn't even make any sense. If anything, the sun would make it work better because it would heat it up. Like, what the fuck? I don't know why my, my brain does what it does. I don't know why it does what... Stop picking up a face behind me as... Also, don't do that. I'm kind of having a screw it moment and not even worrying about just hitting the bleached parts. It's not even going to matter if it hits the darker parts of my hair. It's not going to show up. And even if it did, I wouldn't care. I'm, I'm just tired of sitting here. I just want to go outside while it's still sunny and quiet. All right, let's get the fuck outside. turned out my pants are soaking wet my pants are so you guys how did it turn out does it look all right does it look okay my pants are soaking wet I did the thing where I leaned my upper body into the shower and just like turned on the shower head and dried my hair that way and it I got my pants wet I just had to run downstairs and do mom things and apparently I was down there a lot longer than I thought that I was because my hair is starting to dry what does it look like this lighting is awful and also I look scary I know I know that this is probably toxic of me to bring up. But every time I look at my hair and it looks like this, it looks like this. I'm reminded of the fact that I was in a relationship with somebody for four years that tried to tell me that I didn't have curly hair. He literally tried to tell me that I didn't have curly hair. Thinking about straightening it and putting in my hair extensions, Epps is going to be off the clock in about 30 minutes, and I have not done enough vlogging today, but it's because I've been very calm.
Also, if I have one more person try to pressure me into watching the live-action Avatar, I won't. To spite you. Guys, I just deleted the last, I deleted the last six minutes of my vlog. Um, and I thought, I laid down and I thought, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Like, I can finish my vlog in the morning. I can finish it in the morning and it'll be fine, right? Um, also, there's a fucking fly in the room with me right now because it's the most wonderful time of the year. <gasps> it's the most wonderful time of the year, um, the time of the year where there's fucking always a fly in the room with me slowly driving me mad. Anyways, I ended up taking a two-hour nap, which was really not a good thing. It was actually a really, really bad thing because it was between 8 p.m. and 10 p.m. Um, to be fair though, I started to not feel very good at all. I started to feel like absolute trash. And I thought, oh shit, maybe I can lay down and try to sleep. And if I lay down and I fall asleep successfully, maybe I'll sleep until the morning. Maybe I'll sleep until tomorrow. Bitch, it's, stop trying to make sleeping through the night happen. It's not gonna fucking happen. Not for you. Not once, not never. That's not true. Documented, that's not true. I have circadian rhythm upset and sometimes my sleep cycle is fine and sometimes it is what it is right now and sometimes it doesn't fucking exist at all because I don't sleep at all. But anyways, um, I woke up and my hair was wild. I mean, wild. And I decided I'm gonna go downstairs and I'm going to straighten my hair and I'm going to vlog and I ended up deleting the footage. I deleted all of it. All of it. What the fuck is, what are you do? like, what are you doing? What are you doing? Turn to your seat, ma'am. What, like, I mean, I appreciate the volume, but what the fuck are you doing? I deleted it partially because my kids were watching Lilo and Stitch and you could hear Hawaiian roller coaster ride playing in the background. And guys, the, the Disney copyright gods are not merciful. They're not fucking merciful at all. For some reason in their fucking head, they think that you're going to not go to the Disney, what is it called, Vivo account and watch, watch their songs. You're not going to go to Apple Music. You're not going to go to Spotify. You're going to come to my video and watch three seconds of Hawaiian Roller Coaster Ride and they're going to miss out on their coin. That's what they think is going to happen. So they either strike you or claim you or split your revenue and it's like oh my god enjoy the two dollars actually enjoy the one dollar because we have to split the two dollars i feel like the thing with disney movies is that you can't really tell when they're playing in the background until the music starts you can't really tell what's playing in the background you can just hear some things playing in the background and then a song starts going and then it's like oh okay that's extremely fucking identifiable um and then, you know, like three times, it's gotten me in trouble. And the thing with me is that I don't make my kids, like, stop their life for me ever so that I can vlog. Um, and that includes, like, what they're doing in the next room. And the other reason that I deleted the footage was because I just felt really ugly. I just felt really ugly. That's why I'm putting on mascara right now, kind of hoping that that'll help. And also I feel compelled to go to the Dollar Tree tomorrow and get some Just For Men Dollar Tree brand uh, eyebrow dye. It's actually beard dye and put it on my eyebrows because I feel not very attractive right now. I'm gonna keep talking because my kids are asleep but Moana is playing in their room and the song Shiny is on right now and I fucking know if I even breathe for long enough they're gonna be able to hear it and they're not gonna they're not gonna be merciful with me. Yeah, I ended up deleting it partially because I absolutely knew that I was gonna get a get a you I was gonna get the the green this or a red mark 
or a yellow mark for a claim um, because there was a lot of pausing because there was a lot of uh, you know dial up connection sounds happening in here and um, also I just looked I just watched it back and I was just like I feel really ugly right there I can't do it after I watched my footage back and I felt like I couldn't go through with posting it because I just felt gross um, and also was afraid of a claim. I laid down and I tried to go to sleep because Epps fell asleep and the kids are asleep. Um, and I was just rolling around and rolling around and I realized this is not going to fucking happen. It's not going to fucking happen. You may as well go downstairs and finish your vlog. Um, but it's St. Patrick's Day. And I, and I didn't acknowledge it at all. I didn't acknowledge it at all in my vlog. Where I live, St. Patrick's Day is very much just like a holiday where people use it as an excuse to get drunk. I didn't pinch Epps. Oh, I should have pinched Epps. I didn't pinch Epps. I did pinch E. I did pinch E. And he put on a green hoodie after that. But I should have pinched Epps. I should have pinched Epps, but I don't, I don't really pay attention to St. Patrick's Day. It's like where I live, it literally is just like a, a major excuse for people to get drunk. So it's just kind of like something that I don't really think about, especially when the kid, when it happens on a weekend and the kids are in school. Cause when they, when, when it's, when it happens during the weekend, the kids are in school, they have like a party and stuff at school. Um, but yeah, yeah, I, I didn't even acknowledge it, did I? Um, but I'm going to go upstairs and I'm going to try to go back to sleep. <laughs> I'm going to try. Um, my plans for technically today, because it's now midnight 30, I do believe on the dot. Yeah, on the dot. I'm going to film a makeup video today as well as vlog. I have this really pretty look in mind. I saw somebody with really glittery eyelids and I thought I won't that. I want that. And also, I'm going to put this footage in my vlog no matter how ugly I think I look. I'm going to fucking do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to be a big brave dog and I'm going to do it. And I will see you guys tomorrow. Boy, probably for a makeup video. Probably for a makeup video uh, for my next upload. And I will see you then. Bye. Bye. <laughs>